Well, let's start with some good news, some big news, you guys. This is Rockville Road behind me. You can see traffic is now flowing for the first time since this morning. On the north part of the bridge, NDOT crews have worked and successfully opened one eastbound and one westbound lane. Still somewhat of a choke point. It won't totally fix the traffic issues, but it'll, it'll seriously improve them. So for now, though, uh, 465 northbound still remains closed. Earlier today, a semi truck, of course, pulling a car crusher, was driving north on 465 when, for some reason, a hydraulic arm on the crusher raised up and slammed into the bridge. Debris fell on cars below, as you can see. Uh, here it caused major damage to this car. One motorist sent to the hospital with a broken arm. Investigators say it's one of the worst bridge crashes they've seen, and they're thankful no one was seriously hurt. Unexplainably, the arm on this piece of equipment extended. Uh, we don't know if it was a mechanical failure, if somebody accidentally hit a button. 4 of the bridge's 14 major support beams now need replaced work that will take weeks. A big priority again all evening has been getting that north half of Rockville Road open that should relieve some traffic issues for